The Mandalorian Thoughts, Season 1, Season 3, Episode 1, The Prostrate. I mean, The Apostate. And, yeah, uh, I like this season opener. It was engaging, and I am excited to see where we go from here. And, yeah, so we open with this ceremony of the kid getting the helmet. I don't know how I feel about... I'm, I'm not the first person to point out. I, I just got done watching Just Gender's excellent video on the episode. She pointed out as well, it, you know, at the start of the scene, we can't quite tell... I, I thought that that was a young Din Djarin as well, that that was, you know, but no, it's present day... Which we realize when the the starfighter based, you know, Naboo starfighter based new Mando vessel flies in and and helps out. And I don't know. I I guess I just feel a little bit like it should have been made clearer because until I saw that, I was almost certain that that was a young Din Djarin, But yeah. And. Yeah, I mean, I guess they weren't expecting that giant lizard thing. You know, I, th I thought we wouldn't see it until later. It's been a while. But yeah, great fight between all the, the Mandalorians and it, and great CGI on it. Looked absolutely, just completely... Ah, what's the word? Um... Yeah, it, it you know, if I didn't know it was animation, I would have thought, oh, I guess they just found a giant alligator, tamed it, and filmed, you know, somehow. But no, it's... And... See. Yeah, and, and, you know, the fact that, you know, Din really saves, like, they were... They were doing what they could, but they were struggling against this thing. He comes in, manages to, you know, really help kill it, and the, you know, the armor is still like, well, I don't know what, what you think you're doing here, uh, Mr. Helmet Off. You know, I, I thought I made my feelings on, on this matter quite clear. Uh, you know, so, yeah, there there is still that, you know, the only way for him to be accepted is if he bathes in those waters, which, I mean, you can only go so long without bathing before people start, you know, being bothered by it, but yeah, uh, the yeah we find out you know the the IG statue, you know, yeah I I like that that was straight up like, yeah you know I mean of course they made a statue of him that's that's exactly the kind of thing if if not for IG eleven, you know blowing himself up at the 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 lava thing you know yeah that's that's it there's no you know so. Uh, Navarro would not be in any kind of, in, in anything resembling the state it is now. So, yeah, makes sense that they would idolize him. I'm sorry, sir, but there are people to see you. There are, there are pirates in the courtyard. Pirates in the courtyard, didn't they? I feel like that, wasn't that a punk band in the 90s or something? And, yeah, you know, they're like... I'm telling you, I want to drink here. And he's like, this is a school. The liquor here is terrible. And the they do the, the quick draw thing. And yeah, you know, I'm, I'm never going to complain about the, the, the Western feel to, to this show and Boba Fett, the Book of Boba Fett, you know. So, yeah. And... Yeah, you know, um, crap, I forget his name. Grief Karga makes it clear. Navarro is no longer friendly to pirates. If you come and you've got, like, a skull on your shirt or a flag or something, you had better be the Punisher. And, you know, it's like, I, I need a new marshal. And, like, Din is like, what, what about Marshal Dune? And he's like, um, right, she, um, hmm, she can't... She can't come to the phone right now. She, uh, there's a, she, she forgot to turn the oven off. Uh, oh, oh, her planet needs her. Ah, wow, she, she died on the way back to her home planet. 
And, um, no, no, Cara Dune is not... I, I mean, I don't blame them for not bringing her back, considering, but... Yeah, I appreciate that they didn't just recast and pretend like it's not, you know, yeah, okay, she, what was it, she got drafted into Special Forces because of what she did in, in Season 2. Yeah, okay, I can, I can buy that. Let's see, and, yeah, we see that, you know, Din Djarin, still, the only true, the only droid he trusts is that IG droid, and I appreciate that they did actually, I'm, I'm, I would be extremely surprised if that wasn't actually Taika Waititi voicing, you know, even though, like, they threw a filter on it because he's, like, you know, he's he's not in the best of state, but Taika Waititi has a very distinct voice, so, yeah, very cool that they brought him back. And, yeah, uh, I'm never going to complain about a Terminator feel to something, you know, so, so yeah, the part where he's, like, clawing his way at and grabbing and, you know, must, like, he doesn't, I don't, he doesn't say, wait, did he say terminate? He's, he certainly said, you know, must, you know, he has to, he has to kill the, the, just, yeah. And they bring back Babu Frick and his species. You know, i it's not really surprising, uh, you know, this show tries to find a balance between the macho and the cute to, to bring in everyone, uh, you know, every, everyone that finds something about Star Wars appealing. You're probably going to find some of it in here. And, yeah, the, the I guess maybe not so much the, the romance stuff, but other than that, you know. And you do have the, the yeah, I, I did like the, you know, if, if, there's there's this one shot that like reveals no 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 they're you know it makes sense that they're the place they have is the size of them you know why would it be the size of you know I guess apparently you're supposed to be like outside like grief was and you know so so he's sitting there in this like cramp thing it's just, that was I I like that I like that reveal. They they played it exactly right, you know. It, 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 I'm I'm so glad that they didn't have like some kind of cringe comedy about like ah oh, I can barely fit in here or you know we see him struggling to climb through. No, 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 just show that he's in there. Just yeah, and yeah, as usual, uh, you know, it's based around a quest. That's that's usual for for Mandalorian. So. He, you know, he, he has to get to, get back to Mandalore and find the, the water thing. We, we, you know, we knew that part already, but in this episode he gets directions from Bo-Katan, and the, um, you know, he decides he's going to, he's going to go there, but he wants the, the IG droid active and, and helping him there. And so, yeah, what was it? New, new memory, something or other, you know, some, something like that. So, yeah, that's the, you know, next, next thing, next episode is presumably going to have him trying to find that part. And yeah, let's see. I, I appreciate that we see that the new ship is great for dog fights, and you know, mostly enjoy the the pirate thing. I love the design of the the you know yeah I mean, you know Jesse Gender already does a really great job talking about it but the the pirate captain the only thing I love that they are using practical effects to the degree that they can in Star Wars still I'm really really glad I got to say some of the mouth movement like it's clearly an animatronic mouth and like the thing with that you got to be extremely careful that it doesn't break the the immersion, break break the illusion, and I gotta say there were it it didn't move completely the way that it just yeah. But other than that, absolutely loved it. And yeah, um, I like the scene between Man Din and Bo Katan. That was also and and you know we're gonna see how the the relationship is going to where, where it's going to go from here and you know she now she knows that he's going there she right now she says she's not going to go with 
and yeah, we're gonna we're gonna see if that really is the yeah if if she might end up joining anyway. But yeah, really really glad that she's still working. You know, she's still just so freaking good in in these sci-fi shows. So that is it. Yeah, looking forward to to next week's and. Um, don't think I have anything else to say. Uh, yeah, uh, there should be one or two more videos this week, so stay tuned for that. And if not, I hope to catch you next week. This is the way.